JCPS Superintendent Marty Polio outlined his future plans in his State of the District address tonight. WDRB's Katrina Nichols shows us three things he's focused on for next year. I believe this 2022 will mark the year for the boldest and most change in JCPS in the history of this district. Superintendent Marty Polio outlining his plan for JCPS in the next year. One of his top goals? addressing student assignments. It is one of the most controversial issues. He says the policies have not been reviewed in almost 40 worse, years. This is right now the district has 50 different feeder patterns, which is how students transition from middle to high school. Uh, our students sense of belonging. Polio wants to cut the patterns down dogs. to about a dozen. We've evaluated whether our current student assignment plan supports student engagement and supports a sense of belonging and supports student outcomes. And I have to say this, I believe this. It does not. It is time for a change. Polio hopes to present a proposal to the board by the end of the school year. Along with student assignments, Polio wants to address bell times, which is something he's already suggested to the school board and says goes hand in hand with student assignments. We know asking students, high school and middle school students, to get up at 5.30 and 6 in the morning is not healthy for our students, their mental health, their physical health, and the outcomes that come with that. Polio also hopes to at least address staff shortages, not only for teachers, but custodians, bus drivers, and other staff. If we don't address this and make a change, this nation will be facing a major crisis in 10 years, and I am committed to doing what I need to do to make sure we support the educators in JCPS. Superintendent Polio also took time to talk about the last two years, saying he's proud of the district's COVID-19 response and the, and the expansion it brought to their technology resources. Katrina Nickel, WDRB News.